birthday. Hello, everybody. Happy birthday to me. Well, hello. We are back at the bulk food store because today is a special day. Today, January the 11th, is Maddox's birthday. And if you don't know who Maddox is, he is my pug who will be turning 12 this year. So we're just here to buy some ingredients for his birthday cake. And we were just seeing if we should get Maddox anything for his birthday. He usually likes these things. And it's been a while since we bought him one, but after further inspection, we learned. Woolly sticks, ingredient, beef pizzle. What does that mean? And in French, it's penis de boeuf. So if you're buying your dog this, they're chewing on bull penis. Why don't they just write beef penis here? Why do they call it a pizzle? Is just that the scientific name? It's just another way the industry's hiding things from you guys. Because who's gonna go and say, Hey, can you go pick up some bull penis for right over here? Fido? Can you pick up some eight inch pizzles? Back from the grocery store, got some peanut butter and some flaxseed meal. This is for Maddox's birthday cake. We're gonna grate some carrots in it. We found these cliff bars on sale for only 99 cents. Mm. Hopefully they taste good. We've never tried it before, but they look really good. Yeah, I'm excited to try this one. White chocolate macadamia nut. So it's white chocolate flavored chips made with dried cane syrup, cocoa butter, soy flour, soy lecithin, and vanilla extract. So there's no milk in it. Chocolate chip peanut crunch a chocolate chip, a regular one, oatmeal raisin walnut, this sounds like a good combination, and coconut chocolate chip. Before we start baking our cake, Raj is making himself a veganese spinach sandwich. Veganese. Open face sandwich. Yep. Soup that we made a couple of days ago. Just scrounged it up. Just gonna finish it off with big, portion of rice and Priscilla is excited to get the party started Foxy is also here today to celebrate Maddox's big one two really good vegan A's spinach you can also change that up with kale as well got some organic rye bread with uh, sunflower seed oh we bought this the other day chlorella powder this is a broken cell wall, fresh water algae, use for smoothies. Mmm, I love eating broken cell walls of fresh water algae. Rosh was not a big fan of it. It kind of tastes like seaweed to me. It tastes like you're drinking a soup, but uh, if you mix it with like maybe maple syrup or your smoothie on its own, do not recommend it. But it's chock full of vitamin B12 and iron and yeah. magnesium and zinc and all this good stuff. So two teaspoons will give you 100% of your B12, 20% iron, 15% riboflavin, and 15% manganese. But I'd rather have these greens, hot and sour soup. If you guys don't know what that is, that's a Chinese soup, traditional Chinese soup. Dean made it the other day. This has got some tofu in it, bamboo, this is black fungus. I know it looks weird. Very traditional Chinese. I don't know, but it tastes pretty good. I like it. Mm -hmm. Bamboo shoots. A whole lot of white pepper. Like almost two teaspoons of white pepper, which gives it a really spicy kick. And balsamic vinegar. Like my suspenders. Very cool. I dressed up for Maddox's birthday. Oh yeah. Look who has decided to join me. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Foxy's hey, decided to join us for lunch. <laughs> Go back, Piercy. It's too spicy for you. Have some rice crackers. We just bought these yesterday. It is, as you can see here, nori flavor, seaweed flavor. 
check out these rice cakes. Chock full of seaweed. Chock full of seaweed. There's so much just seaweed. Filled with seaweed. It's just overpowering the rice flavor. I don't even know what to do. It tastes so plain. <laughs> it's just a plain rice cake. It has no nori flavor at all. Nope. So we're making the dog cake now. As you can see, it is vegan. It's supposed to have egg, but I'm using flaxseed meal. If you can't find this, this is just ground up flax seeds basically. We'll let that sit for like five, ten minutes. And the wet ingredients are gonna consist of apples and carrots. Just have to grate them. I will grate these while I wait for the flax seeds. <laughs> I'm a great grater. You're a great grater. This is organic peanut butter, no preservatives, all natural. We need the best for our dogs. When's the cake gonna be ready? Gosh! Maddox is turning 12. How do you feel, Raj? How do you feel about having a geriatric dog? It doesn't matter how old dogs get, they'll always be your babies. Mix this up and it'll be ready to bake. If you don't have a mixer, that's okay. Just use a hand mixer. Who needs a KitchenAid? It's my birthday, it's my birthday. <laughs> Hello everybody! Happy birthday to me! Maddox, it's your birthday. You look so sad. Happy birthday, Maddox. <laughs> I'm not sad, I'm a pug. When's this party gonna start? Where's the food? Oh, I have to check on the cake. Sorry the cake's not cool, Jet. Have a snack in the meantime. Hmm, not sure if it's safe. So we put a nice layer of peanut butter icing on each cake and we're having chili tonight and as the man of the hour we introduce you this lovely <laughs> lovely attire for this evening's meal we have cake to be served we have cake my dear okay this is the biggest i think you should give it to priscilla okay this is romantic yeah all right happy, happy birthday, birthday to you, you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Maddox. Happy birthday to you. Whoa, whoa, she's standing on the table. She Get down. 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 And many more. Oh, please don't like that. Okay, chow down, guys. Chow down, guys. Already eaten. Mmm, Priscilla, you have your own. Oh, hers is in the plate still. Here you go, Priscilla. Oh my god, she loves it. She loves it so much. Mm, she loves it. Nice and soft on the teeth, eh, Maddox? Oh yeah, Maddox also has a few teeth missing. Whoa, Priscilla. You're gonna lick that cake. You're gonna lick that piece of cake right off the table. <laughs> Look at this one. Look at this one. I don't even give a crap about this cake. <laughs> oh my god, he's eating such a big chunk. It's a shark. Bring it up. Oh, she's taking huge chomps. Okay, no dinner for you guys. Uh -oh. Uh oh. She's not even like devouring. She's just like. No, she's taking little nibbles here and yeah, there. Like... Snacking on it. So the dog cake is a hit, guys, even for the pickiest of dogs. Foxy right here. Yeah, they do like it. She just has some strange eating habits, but she does like it. Happy birthday, Maddox! Happy birthday, Maddox! I hope you liked it. Hope you like your cake. Wow, we cook our chili. We'll be having some tea, and I'm gonna try this for the first time—a Cliff Bar. I just tried it. I tried it before you. It's How good. was it? Oatmeal raisin walnut. I would definitely buy that one again. So it's like an oatmeal cookie, 
in bar form. These are the vegetables we're putting into our chili. Carrots, banana, peppers, add a bit of a kick. Corn, zucchinis, mixed beans, diced onion, and a couple of cloves of garlic. Authentic hand-smashed tomatoes. <laughs> And some chili, chili powder. Paprika, cayenne, oregano, cumin, onion and garlic powder. Very delicious. And very cheap to make it yourself versus buying it in store. Oh, Raj is eating some of the birthday cake. It's very easy to make. It has two carrots, two apples. Oh, there's flax seeds in here too, which is Great for you because it has omega-3, but also great for the dog's fur, apparently. Mm. So these are the Cliff Bars we hauled today. Dee's eager to try another one. I'm what are we to trying try now? This one. White chocolate macadamia nut. Let us know what you think. Tastes like white chocolate. Oh yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh. Very good. <laughs> Stirring the chili, eating Cliff Bars. Not too sweet, nice crunch. I never thought I would get to eat white chocolate again, but it's pretty good. It's coming together very nicely, and to thicken it, I'm just gonna add a bit of oatmeal. This is my secret. Here we have our chili, along with a side of a variety of breads, and some baked french fries with various herbs and spices. Also, we have in here hot, hot dogs. dogs. You guys gotta try these. These are Eve's hot dogs. They're they pretty good. Taste very, very real. Watch's mom wanted to show you her creation. So if you guys have ever had Asian baos or what they're called, they're Asian steamed bread that usually wrap meat or other fillings in. This is just bao, so there's nothing in it. It's all vegan. We're gonna have this for dessert afterwards. We hope you guys enjoyed our vlog. We hope you guys enjoyed Maddox's birthday. And Maddox's birthday. Thank you for joining us. Maddox thanks you too. And we'll see you next time on the Kale Sandwich Stories. Time for me to eat.